good YouTube. It's your girl Brings. Your girl has not done a freaking video in the last seven days. And the funny thing about it is that I have footage from, well, a little bit of footage from the carnival show and then very, very little footage from um, Atlantis because Atlantis went by so fast, you guys. Carnival, I was like the closing number. So like I had nothing but time on my hands to like pretty much record content but carnival also had a lot of things going on so there was supposed to be three makeup artists the one that i signed up for did not show up you guys note to self i have been working around the clock sometimes four to three hours of sleep like right before i had to get up to work the next morning and you guys know i just started a new job so i was nine to six during my training right now i'm on my regular schedule of 11 to 8 p.m but during that time frame up until today aka monday i was nine to six p.m and i'm talking about you guys going to sleep at five in the morning turn around and getting up at 8 30 going to sleep at six in the morning turn around and getting up at 8 30 like i literally have been going hard on these designs for the last three weeks the show is finally over. I did catch up on some sleep on Saturday, Saturday night into Sunday show for Atlantis because you guys know I finished Atlantis set first anyway. Um, and I'm pretty glad that I did it that way because if I didn't, what would have happened is I would have been staying up late Saturday night, like right after the carnival show to get things finished for Atlantis. And I was dog tired, you guys, after the carnival show. So Things might not have gotten finished if I had I done it that way. But I am glad that I did it that way because as soon as I got home, you guys, from going out to eat with my mom, like right after the show, and like took a shower, washed my makeup off, like I literally crashed, you guys. I crashed. I was out for the count. Uh, and then I did also, I told you guys that the makeup artist did not show up. So I didn't bring my makeup because I had just went to sleep like 7 a.m. and had to turn around around 11 o'clock to get to the venue for like rehearsal and all of that stuff. Mm -mm. The girl slept till noon. <laughs> First of all, the girl slept till noon. <laughs> Got up. I had to finish my last pair of carnival wings. Finished those up. Then took my shower. Hit the road. Um, but I had to do my own makeup, you guys. I did not bring anything. Only thing I had in my suitcase was my brushes. My makeup brushes was the only thing I had in that doggone suitcase, y'all. So imagine not having makeup and only having freaking makeup brushes. So I'm literally having to do something to my face myself because I think I'm about to get pampered, y'all. Like, I've been like, I'm to like I want to relax. I want somebody else to do my face for me. But you guys have those videos coming. I might lump both fashion show videos together, just make it like half and half, do an introductory to Atlantis and then showcase those stuff. And then start it off with Carnival and showcase everything for Carnival. Um, I do already have the pictures back for, from Carnival. So you guys will get to see a lot of, of photos from that show. Um, Atlantis has not came back yesterday yet because it was just yesterday. Um, but other than that, I have a DIY that I still need to post you guys. And I don't even know if I'm going to, um, continue to post the, um, the last sneak peek preview of um, one of the outfits. Cause I did do one of those as well. Um, and then the DIY wings video. Um, but yeah, you guys, like I have content that I need to edit and post, but I haven't really been focused on it because I've been focused on getting that stuff done for both shows. And now that they're over, like I have all this content <laughs> that I have yet to put out. Um, but I have not done any cooking, you guys. Yesterday 
we kind of picked up picked up food after the show came home and then that was that the weekend before i was kind of just going hard on the designs i didn't cook that weekend either nobody cooked that weekend either you guys i think we went did we go out to eat i can't even remember nope i don't remember y'all but anyways you guys i'm going to make a quick um wings recipe i don't know if you guys know or not but sweet baby ray's got some garlic buffalo so you guys i'm like i'm really excited to try this i'm going to try to make some good crunchy crisp wings okay to put this sauce on i think i have some more sauce in the refrigerator not sure which kind um, okay, so maybe I don't. <laughs> we can do some honey chipotle wings. I have that in Sweet Baby Ray's too. If you guys remember my little Raymond experiment, <laughs> we could do those too. Um, this is going to be like a really, really quick video, you guys. I'm just trying to do something so I can put this out. And I am on my lunch right now, so I'm going to have to get back in, you know, to get to work. Um, I'm going to clean his chicken, put it in the oven. Of course, I'm going to make TK's regular baked chicken. He likes baked chicken, you guys. That's all he really eats. That's all he really eats. And we're going to go from there, you guys. I will show you what it's looking like once it's seasoned and everything. Um, but yeah, I'll be back. <laughs> all right, guys. So for, so for TK's pan, these are the seasonings I used. All right. And if you take away the rotisserie and garlic and add the kicking chicken seasoning, those are the ones that I use for my pan. Like I said, I'm keeping it very, very light. This is his pan of drumsticks. This is my pan of wings. And we're gonna go ahead and put these on in the oven. And then I will go ahead and check in you guys when they are like um, pretty much done and getting sauced so stay tuned all right y'all so i have been eating so late here lately mostly because of the fashion shows and then also this new work schedule has been kind of throwing me off because to be honest i'm not used to um getting back on task with like adherence and um timed breaks y'all i didn't used to have to do all of that <laughs> i didn't have to do all of that for six years y'all so it's 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 a process of me getting back to having to take breaks at certain times having to take lunches at certain times um not going over 10 minutes of like at a break or at a lunch times so, like it's it's a lot you guys so <laughs> i am just trying to get to a position where i am better with it so to say um and i'm also getting to a, back to a position where i'm back on the healthy tip because i have been eating kind of unhealthy um i have not been in the gym lately <laughs> so i need to get back in the gym for one um which i'm going to be working on this week and then i also need to get back on my healthy eating kick um so i'm kind of starting that today you guys that's kind of why i made wings um and i'm pairing it with my veggies so our guys got some cucumber got some carrots got some celery um we're gonna do some little uh, ranch bowl in the middle and wings over here are pretty much done look at tk chicken um wings over here are done I like them a little bit more crisp than what they are currently y'all but it is super late and i'm not used to eating after like seven o'clock y'all seven o'clock max six o'clock if i can help it honestly but seven o'clock max and it's going on 10 y'all and that's another thing that has been affecting my weight gain so i really need to get on it get back onto my processes and get back to my goals so now that i have the fashion shows out the way there's nothing hindering me um as far as that's concerned because i don't know when the next time i'm going to do another model call or um, be included in a fashion show i think there's one coming up in october but that's so far away like i'm not even going to worry about that right now but yeah you guys like that's kind of where i am currently 
And I feel like even with um, the fashion show being in October, I probably might just put another, um, I might just bring in like one of the mermaid looks and then one of the carnival looks and then the rest of the outfits just kind of design and figure out where to go from there, so to say. Um, so to be honest, you guys, I am not going to use the Hawaiian sauce. I am just going to strictly use this garlic buffalo sauce from Sweet Baby Ray's. Um, just for the fact that I don't have a second pan and I don't want to mess up a bowl by mixing the Hawaiian sauce in another bowl and kind of putting it, it on that chicken. So we're just going to use all one, one sauce, y'all. Maybe next time I'll experiment. I do have another bag of wings in the freezer. So maybe next time I'll just use the um, the Hawaiian. The Hawaiian Chipotle sauce. But for this pan, we are definitely about to use this garlic buffalo. Sweet baby rays, garlic buffalo. And I'm going to put this back in the oven. And let it bask in this sauce on broil. And then y'all, it'll be time to eat. So I used quite a bit of this sauce. This is what it's looking like, y'all. That's what it's looking like. I'm gonna throw it in the oven on broil for like five-ish minutes, five to 10 minutes, and then I'll be back. All right, y'all. So this is the presentation with the wings. I have to let y'all know, I don't think Sweet Baby Ray can do any wrong. This sauce is absolutely Bruh. delicious. Listen to him. And I know that looks like a margarita, you guys. The funny thing about that is like, that is one of the drinks that I am hooked on right now, but it's actually a limeade, just a plain old limeade. Freaking delicious limeade at that. But <laughs> this is the final look, you guys. Look at them sauced wings, sauce broiled wings. I got some celery, like I said, um, cucumber and carrots. That's the only bit of ranch I had, you guys. I need to buy some more ranch, but I do have blue cheese in the refrigerator as a backup. So if all of this is not last, blue cheese will be refilling this cup. But <clears throat> that is it, you guys. Final product. That is it. No short, short video, guys. And I pretty much was doing follow-ups on all of it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until next time, you guys, I will see ya. <laughs>